Today we open Blue Eyes Destiny Mystery Packs. All right, guys, time for our weekly brainstorming session. This week, I want to get the people hyped. We have to open something epic. I'm thinking like Blue Eyes White Dragon. What about Destiny? It's our destiny to pull the blue eyes. Uh, sure? You know, like, gotta catch them all, you know it's my destiny. I think you have the wrong children's card game. Hear me out, hear me out. Burst of Destiny, Rise of Destiny, Legend of Blue Eyes, all pretty epic sets, right? Yeah. Blue Eyes Destiny. You just, you just shove the words Together. Blue Eyes Destiny! Okay, fine, fine, whatever, we'll try it. What's up, guys? We're back with another epic video. Today, we're opening a ton of Blue Eyes Destiny mystery packs. We also have a special Ruxin pack. Look at that. One ghost, ultra, one secret, and one common. There's a ghost in this pack. So be prepared for that one. That's gonna be pretty epic. We will also be opening, speaking of ghosts, a display of ghosts from the past, too. So this is gonna be a pretty fun video. But first, we have some notes from Sauce TCG. So Ruxin, if you don't get anything special, the Ruxin pack is 100% gonna blow your mind have fun and bless the pulls 1200 packs made one out of six packs contains a card worth eight dollars plus last time we didn't get one but i'm feeling like we're gonna get one with the rucks and pack this time six packs 25 dollars at sauce tcg that's on instagram so go check them out if you guys want to buy some of those blue eyes destiny the top chase cards two mrl blue eyes tune first edition wow the uh gold blue eyes white dragon two of those one pck blue eyes two jump blue eyes one jump ulti dragon the paladin of white dragon first edition from mfc that's big black cluster soldier envoy that is not a blue eyes card but i guess Destiny? I don't know. Try on Dragon. Wavy print. Whoa, okay. And then a Golden Scrub Golden taken hand-drawn Blyze Ultimate artwork framed. So this is what you can win as well. So this thing is pretty cool. I do have artwork from this guy. And uh, if you guys check out my Instagram or Twitter, you could have seen it. And it's pretty insane. So pretty cool. And then uh, here's more chase list, four or more. And you know what the best part about this is? You guys can win all the pulls in this video. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, and let me know your favorite item that we pull. I guess card is the word. I mean, technically it could be item if it's that picture. All right, we've gone on long enough. Let's get into it. Let's start off with one. It goes from the past two. I'm pretty excited to get into opening. Let's see if we can pull something amazing. Also, hope you guys enjoyed that skit at the beginning. I had fun making that, so I hope you th guys at least, you know, enjoyed it. Didn't think it was too dumb. I mean, not was not dumb of course it was not dumb. okay no, just kidding okay let's just keep going let's see what we can do so out of these it's one hollow in every five wait what one hollow in every five card pack okay there we go so it's a five card pack unless they what if it was a four card pack there'd be no hollow epsilon got the uradora fate and the palladium oracle mana secret not secret what do they call that it's a parallel secret rare i don't remember something like that but uh let's keep going i think we can pull something amazing in this video reptilian spawn sacred waters in the sky it's a pretty good card chimeric fortress and the vampire domination so we are off to a slow start but many packs to go i didn't even count how many packs it was like 15 to 20 packs of these sauce ccg pack shout out to sauce tcg for always sending us these and you know giving us some fun content and even if you don't like the repack stuff it's at least fun to watch so if you guys are interested though you can check out his instagram tara we got the uh, beaver word this is all lob stuff and oh and it's a half an lob pack a guy of the dragon champion secret rare this is off to a hot start very very nice only a couple packs in we've already gotten a secret rare let's see if we can get a ghost rare as well because i mean that would just make an epic video i'm down for that let's do this great mammoth we got the alien ammonite odd eyes rebellion the hella we got the Anmoraki. All right, Anmoraki. I don't even remember that card. We opened 13, 14 cases of that set. Blue Eyes Destiny, one hollow in every pack. It seems like he went pretty hard on this one. Like 1,200 packs is more than normal. He has a ton of chase cards. I'm pretty excited. It'd be pretty cool if we could pull something. Insector Hopper, Parametaphol's Fusion. We got the Dogmatica Genius, or Genesis, I should say. And Defcon Bird. Okay, very nice. It is tough to win, though, with these repack packs on the YouTube video. So, like, last time we didn't pull anything, and everybody's like, these are a scam. You know, you didn't pull anything. But then if you pull something, they're like, they loaded it. So that you would know you know that you would show off how good they are but like he's super legit he has numbers of cards like specifically there's two mrl first or whatever so if i don't pull it that just means that there's a better chance for other people to pull it i mean if i do pull it, it's actually worse for you guys so it's probably better that i don't in the end for everyone buying them go ahead pull we've got the tri brigade we've got the uh chris draw on halka fibrax formerly a very expensive card now it has fallen from grace thanks to ghosts from the past two and look at this 
we might pull another one today. <laughs> I'm saying that, not, not that I don't want to pull something good. I mean, it's going to you guys either way because I'm giving it away. So let's see if we can get something awesome. Plunder Patrol Ship and Doo 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 Duo DDD, not Doo Doo Doo. I just enjoy opening this stuff. It's super fun and I enjoy that I get to open it for you guys on this video. So once again, let's just see what we can get. We got the Win the Wind Charmer. The Maple Maiden. All right, the Archfiend Staff of Despair. I've never even seen that card. What's that from? Um, Blazing Vortex, yeah. Blazing Numbers of Fire. And we've got uh, Mech Lord Army Deployer. Okay, so, so far we've gotten, what, a Secret Rare and then a Hawk Fibrax. Not bad pulls overall, like compared to like regular packs, still pretty good. With the Agent of Creation, we've got the Aluber, the Jester of Despia. This guy has gone down to about, what, 15 bucks or something like that last time I checked. Still, $15 card. I mean, not bad. Okay, on to the next pack. Sauce TCG. What can he bless it? Wait, did I leave it? No, I didn't leave a card in there. Okay, Masaki Legendary Swordsman. I specifically remember this from my childhood. Armed Dragon Blitz. Okay, oh, Rux and Special right into the rear, which is in Zector Hornet. Lord of D Super Rare from the original starter deck Kaiba. This is a very old card. Very, very old. The most recent print of it was 2004. So at, at most, it's eight or at least 18 years old so pretty cool at least that just sounds weird let's see what we can get we got the heavenly dragon circle the despia theater of the branded vision hero increase the teeny spirit and we've got ghost trick mummy very very cool but what we are looking for is that i mean what's the best pull like blue eyes tune or blue eyes white well I didn't even see blue. Well, there's no uh, LOB blue eyes, at least. Mutant, mutant, uh, mutant, I should say. Psychic Wilder, not bad card. It's a rare, though. And, oh, and an ultimate rare. Blue eyes, white dragon. And I do know from our $1,000 video, if you guys go check out that video where I spent $1,000 on TCG player, and we recently reviewed it to see, like, how my money was doing. This card has gone up of a couple bucks, so it's about $10. So we did hit an $8-plus card this time. Not bad at all. An ultimate rare blue eyes will be in the giveaway, so make sure you guys enter that. Turn on your notifications uh, to get entered into that. The Sacred Widers of the... I don't know what I'm saying, but yeah, make sure you guys enter that giveaway. We got the Smorg. We got the silver silver vine we got the radiant and we got the yellow dragon ninja it may not be worth something but benedict cumberbatch is looking good in this picture that's all i'm saying <laughs> that was such a dumb joke i'm sorry that was so dumb okay let's keep going sign at conflict we got the domain of the true monarch chaos grafford the fossil machine and the shadow vampire i had something i was gonna say totally forgot because of that joke let's see what we can pull now because so far pulls have been pretty decent homunculus the alchemic being we've got full metal homunculus we get the Hell Metal Metaphors. I can't speak at all. Fire Opal and the Hieratic Seal. <laughs> I'm literally like not even saying words at this point. I'm just blip, 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 blip. Let's keep going. Crimson Knight. Glow Up Bloom. The Fallen Sanctuary. Yazzy. And the Track Black. All right, Track Black. Let's go. Sauce TCG. Bless us with something amazing. But wait, 50% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel according to this graph. So go down below and click that subscribe button. Suijin Rare from uh, Dark Legends, not Dragons of Legends. That's pretty cool. Exo Sister Armament, the Parametaphals. Smile Potion and the Paladin of Dark Dragon. So there's a, you know, blue eyes. We have Paladin of White Dragon first edition in here, possible as well. Whew, let's go. DDD, Savant Thomas. We got the Form of Pal. We have the Agent of Life Neptune. Not a bad card there. Despot 001 and the Sanctum of Parshath. Very cool. I feel like we got more packs this time. He didn't make 1,200 packs this time versus like 400 of the last one. So yeah, definitely made a lot. We got the Centipede. We got the Fabled Abunk. The Great Double Casted. And the Sage with Eyes of Blue. This is an over $8 card, I think. This card well it might have gone down but it was like 10 bucks when i was making my blue eyes deck so solid card right there which is weird because i guess everyone just likes blue eyes because blue eyes is terrible <laughs> why is the blue eyes support cost so much probably just because of nostalgia but it's not good Doppel warrior krishan alk fibrex we pull one out of the sauce packs and out of the ghost from the past two pretty cool and a rare fish we got ourselves a rare fish pretty cool go fish we got a rare fish let's see what we got these packs are like open super super nicely souls of the forgotten the armored glass the dark gray turtle oath and can we get another lob card oh it is secret rare bpt 2003 print blue eyes and yes it is not near mint condition it's probably moderately played ish something like that i mean it's definitely not lightly played maybe even a little bit worse but that's still an amazing pull a 2003 10 promo and it's a blue eyes so cool still mad they didn't make this the sdk artwork but still really awesome okay we are getting some good pulls so far we haven't hit like the crazy high rolly pulls, but we have pulled some amazing stuff. We got Despia, pretty good. We got the Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon Overlord and the Uranus. We got a Uranus, very nice. Let's see what the next pack will be. Can we get another Blue Eyes White Dragon? The Virtual World Submarine Tour Ride. We got the Fabled Bank. 
the Castell Sky Blaster Musketeer, and a Master of Chaos. That's not a bad card. It was around six bucks last I checked, but that was like when Battles of Chaos like, came out a week later or whatever. So probably not that anymore, but maybe it has held. Who knows? We got the Agent of Force Mars, Dark Alligator, the Vampire Takeover. And the Agent of Miracles, Jupiter. Very cool. I think this might have been 20 packs. It feels like our stacks are very even right now. Now we have a Dream Clown. Psychic Tracker. A lot of Psychics. Fabled. We got the uh, Ukiyo Punk Rising. And the Time Thief Retrograde from Ghost from the Past 1. I gotta say, if I did get Ghost from the Past 1 Ultra Rares as my, uh, as my rare slot, that would be pretty unfortunate. But, you know. That's just how it goes. Plunder Patrol. We got the uh, the Go. We've got uh, the Contract with Void and the DD Lamia. Very cool. So far, all the, the rare slots have been pretty decent, though, other than those Ghosts from the Past 1 ones. Skull, Servant, Armor Dragon with the Clear New World. The Exo Sister, Irene. And the Doom Star Magician from Pevo, which is Pendulum Evolution. Sounds a little creepy, but <laughs> that's what it is. All right, we got a Crimson Knight. Asian of Creation Venus, Galaxy Soldier, about a $3 card, very nice, Cyber Twin, and Chimera Tech Mega Fleet. We are getting down to the last, yep, this looks like the same amount of packs, so I would say this was 20 mystery packs. We have the Gagaga Punk, Gagaga Ku, I should say, Shining with the Icy Breeze, we got the Rise Bell, and the Sandwich, ah, the Sandwich himself, we're getting a Sandwich in our pack, getting a little hungry right now, to be honest, so definitely a nice card, a Sandwich, let's see what we got next, we've got the Executor, the Geomathematech, Outburst, Dark Contract, Pendulum Area, very, very cool. By the way, I will be at YCS Hartford. I want to just say that. So if you guys in the area, you guys show up, I will be there. You know, barring anything that crazy that happens. Forest of the Lost Flowers. We've got back-to-back -back Forest of the Lost Flowers. Okay, weird. Fabled Marcosia. And another Blue Eyes. We got the Hidden Arsenal Dual Terminal version. So it's not the original Dual Terminal. It's the Hidden Arsenal set that everyone kind of hated. But this is a pretty nice card from it, though. So that's pretty sick. Two Blue Eyes in this one. We can't complain there. We're down to the last, I would say, six packs. Yeah, it looks like three of each. We got DD Swirl Slime. Void Cauldron. Boral End Dragon. Very nice. We got the Dot Scaper and the DD Necro Slime. You guys remember pulling that one many, many times from Dimension of Chaos. Very cool. Let's go on to the next one. We have the Neroy. We got the Go Go Punk, which is not the word. It's not the word, but I'm just saying it. S4 Showdown. And Hidden Village of Ninjutsu Arts Secret Rare. Oh, wait. No, we have an extra one of these for some reason. I must have skipped and done the wrong one. We've got a Heinane. Let's go to a second one of these. Gagaku Punk. Gagaku Punk? Gagaku Punk? Hopper, we got the Iganar and the Mass Change. You guys know I love Hero Mass Change. I know a lot of people don't. <laughs> two more packs of each. Let's go. Ghost from the past two. Can we get a Ghost Rare? Heavenly Dragon. Crystal Knock Fibrax. Number three. That's a playset. It's limited now. So, unfortunate. No way you're going to be able to actually play three of those. But uh, maybe three different decks. How about that? You know? Uh, uh, okay. Dark World Thorns here. Starting it off from LOB. We got the Exo Sister. Execta Sword. We got the Skilled Brown Magician. And a Quintet Magician from Ghost from the Past 2 as well. So, a lot of Ghost from the Past 2 stuff in here. One pack of each left. Oh, wait. I forgot. We have an extra one. It's the Ruxin pack. That's why we had an extra one. Ghost Rick Specter. Necro World Banshee, that's a good card. We'll have a Cyber End and Ghost Rick Landard. So the Ruxin pack, whew, here it is. One Ghost, one Ultra, one Secret, and one Common. It's a one of one pack. By the way, you guys can win my Ruxin pack. Just make sure to enter that giveaway. Let's see. It has a Ghost Rare in here. So what do you guys think it'll be? You guys think it'll be a Haunted Mind Ghost Rare? You know, a little bit of cheating on the Ghost Rare? You guys think that's what it's going to be? Or do you think it's going to be something crazy? I don't know if it's going to be at the front. Um. Oh, I see. I see how this works. <laughs> I see how this works. Oh! Okay, first of all, Soggy the Dark Clown, first edition. Wait a second. Oh, no, now I'm bummed. I didn't want to give this away. <laughs> oh, no, this is so cool. <laughs> I definitely do not want to give this away, but I've already committed to it. So check this out. Okay, this is really creative, by the way, because it's like Ghost Rare. Look, and then I just look at it. So this, is this the Ghost Rare test print? Holy crap, this might be the greatest giveaway we've ever done. Okay, first of all, let's leave these up. I'm <laughs> I'm so sad. I wanted this. All right. Very cool. I don't own that. And this is a secret rare test print. Holy crap. Whoa. I thought we were just giving away a ghost rare. This is uh this is this is different. All right. Okay, if you win this, if you win this, I might bribe you to try and win this back. I, maybe I'll maybe I'll buy it off you or something. But this is still gonna be in the giveaway because I said it was gonna be ghost rare test print, I believe. Is it ghost? I don't know what that is. It has to be, I guess. And because look at the colors in it. 
It's crazy. And then the Seeker Rare. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. And then of course, Sagi the Dark Clown, which is pretty cool. But yeah, that is insane. So if you do want to enter the giveaway, make sure to like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications to win that giveaway. Oh, and don't forget to comment. Shout out to TCG Trusted Cards, Tonefo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley Mike, Nance, Mimic Gecko, Drax Stream, Moose, Junior Barding, and then the Tai Show, JT Cho, David FJ, Josh Evans, Clayton Fitzgerald, 87, John Nolan, and Brett Palmer. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.